welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video in this video we're going to be replacing the cam sensor on a VW van slash Luton van which are the same uh, the reason we're pricing it for is because our other one actually went Brought, this was the fault code what come up on it obviously we've had to wait an order for the part to come but now the parts come um, I don't know whether I'm actually going to be able to get the numbers there is a number on here I will try and show it yeah I don't know how well the camera's going to pick it up but if I turn that around for you would help if I got it the right way. There you go. Might be able to pause it, the video, and get it that way. There is one on this end as well. I don't know how well it'll pick it up. It's actually going to be hard to pick that up because of the lighting on it. But yeah, and all you have to do to fit this it's fa fairly straightforward there's nothing hard about it at all it's just all you have to do it's about getting it right and if you come to the top of your rocker cover here and it's all oily which has got to be sorted out because these here on top which is the torque bit bolts what hold it down there this rubber seals round them are actually gone so we've got to replace them as well so all you have to do is get your sensor push it in on the top here like that in that location there and then all you have to do is push it down in our case we are going to have to line it up because obviously we've got the screw to stick in there as well so I don't know how well it'll pick it up. And, uh, let me just find the screw for you. And all you have to do is just get your... It is an Allen key. That's what it looks like. It's only a small one. As you can see. Stick it in there. And screw it down. Now, when you tighten this up, it ain't going to be really tight it's just gonna be just pinched up because obviously we don't want to be cross threading it or anything because we are going into the top of the rocker cover so all you can see look I'll tighten down the best I can like I says it will be easier for you because I'm actually doing it with one hand so as you can see There you go, that's it. I don't want to be going no tighter than that because it's just going to cross thread it. And then all you have to do is get your, your wire connection. Make sure you check inside there to see if there's any green corrosion or anything like that. That can cause a problem as well. And then all you have to do is put your switch on, clip it on, and there you go, job done. That's all there is to replacing your cam sensor on a VW Luton van or van, which are the same. These are the 2.8 engines. But I'm going to actually uh, leave it there now and stop waffling on. I don't want to make the video any longer than necessary. I do like to try and keep them as short as possible for you guys but then um, if I can do it you can do it as you can see it's straightforward job but yeah guys there you go but until next time I'll catch you in another one